I'm just walking and going towards the mountains because I needed to a break from work and I love this tiny street Once you go far away from the main streets, it becomes so quiet, almost no cars, and not that many people around. I'm near the mountain right now, but I'm not going to hike. Um, I was planning to do it together with my friends really soon, and when the weather will be a little bit less hot because right now it's really hard to be outside not that bad as before, but still it's very humid that's why look So I bought myself for lunch this Tonga Kimpap. It's bulgogi with hochujang and basically it's just meat with rice and spicy paste. <laughs> Let's try this out. Thank you. 
We just got back from the supermarket and bought these two buns. They were unsafe. This one is with strawberry and this one, I believe it has some cream inside and I'm not sure what else. <laughs> so we're going to see. Here's the one with the strawberry peeling. It looks beautiful. And the second one looks like this. I'm going to cut it and show you how the filling looks. And here it is. Good morning friends, today I'm making myself oatmeal pancakes. The ingredients are super easy, just one egg, oats, protein powder and the dates. And here is my breakfast, oatmeal pancakes, frozen blueberries and almonds.
So we just got back from the supermarket and I bought myself this Korean melon. I haven't tried it before. I hope it's delicious. And I also bought this pumpkin. It's already peeled and honestly I prefer buying the whole pumpkin with the seeds and everything but I'm going to make a soup or porridge, pumpkin porridge. So I thought that this is a good option. It was quite cheap and we got this black tea for Anton and I'm really excited to cook this porridge or I would say the cream soup I really love pumpkin soup and everything with pumpkin Good morning friends, today for breakfast I'm planning to have some fruits along with the nuts. I have the walnuts and by the way this brand is really nice. I buy them in Home Plus and they're really affordable. one leftover date from yesterday. So we got a gift from our landlord for Chusok and here's some pion. It's uh, sweet rice cakes. I'm going to have them with the coffee. Korean pumpkin soup or Korean pumpkin porridge. It's called hobakjuk. And I already have here peeled pumpkin. It's a kabocha pumpkin, super sweet and nice. And I'm going to cut it into small pieces and then boil it. Boil it for about 10 minutes. So now I'm going to put the pumpkin here and I will mash it with a fork because I don't have a blender but if I had one then I would just blend it and it would be really easy. I think if you have a blender it would be more smooth but <laughs> I'm going to just make it work <laughs> with whatever I have. So here's what we have. I'm going to add a little bit of salt and sugar. And 
And for this recipe we will also need glutinous rice flour. One tablespoon will be enough for us. And now I'm going to put it uh, to the pan again and add the flour. Actually, I think it's quite thick, but I'm going to add just a little bit of flour and water that I've prepared. to stir it for about I don't know two or three minutes and then it's ready so here's my simple and beautiful lunch pumpkin porridge I topped it with some almonds tuna and rice <laughs> 